Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to Trauma. I I am your host, Bacter. Well, uh, sort of. I'm I'm a co-host and co-commentator, along with uh, say hello, Nito King. Hello. I'm the one who played this game. Yeah. So technically, he's your host, and I'm just kind of along for the ride. But I'm super pumped to be playing anything besides Sunset. And uh, tell us about what we're gonna be seeing here. What's what's all this business? I have no idea. <laughs> Good. But the first time you start the game, there's this little introduction. Sure. But you have to pick it out of the menu to watch it at this point. So now this is not something I've played or, or have. Uh, I maybe a browser thing. Uh, but I'm instantly interested. It's, it's, it's European to me. I'm pretty sure it is. And they had all the names in the credits. Oh I yeah. Don't remember which country it's from. And check out the uh, license plate there. Okay, so we're the we're the disembodied car it's leaving. That's kind of spooky. Yeah, you already get to see a bit of the game's aesthetic. Hmm. And the sound design is is pretty good as well too. Yeah, I dig this. Although it does look like they're driving on the uh, the right side of the road there. Hmm. Yeah. So. France, maybe? Yeah, Germany or something like that. Yeah, France or Germany. So we're a photographer. It's late. Uh. Whoa. My dreams are always the same. We dream of crushed teddy bears. And we spend the entire game unconscious. Oh, yeah. Okay. So we are in a um, a hospital, being apparently treated for a car accident. Yep. The titular trauma. Yes. Right. And sure. these four vertical bands here are the four different dreams that she was talking about. That I see. Repeat. And um, are we? If this was our first playthrough, could we select all of them immediately, or are they? Yeah, you can do okay. them in any order. I'm just going to go left to right because. Sure. They are left or right. That's sensible, yeah. Because we will start with the sinister one. This is the dream where I find my old teddy bear wedged under a wing. <laughs> I, I suppose it is. Okay. Yeah, so the aesthetic of the game is all photographs. As sure. far as I can remember, I nothing ever bear. moves unless you I make it move. Get it out from okay. And there are very limited ways to do that. Look at those uh, sigils up there in the top. That's kind of neat. Yep, we'll go take a look at those in a bit, but... Sure. As you move the cursor around, you can see the silhouettes of other photographs, and if you click on one, then your view gets adjusted and you move around. It's neat. And the other control is that you can draw on the screen. Okay. And certain symbols make you do certain things. Sure. Well, if we're... Um wondering about the symbolism to turn it could be that after a traumatic brain injury I find most fears hmm. I remember now yeah the I words are gone and they're all represented the by thing. abstract art yeah we're, we are relearning to connect symbolism with meaning you know that's a, that's a particular function of the brain yep so when we see the symbol in the world we can draw it as it happens you can draw the symbols even before you've seen them but you don't know what symbols to draw right sure I think my oh. first time I got to this tree here, and I just kind of guessed at what symbol might be used at it, and really? it worked. Yeah, really? I guessed it right. Wow, that's some kind of savantism there. Nah, it's a really simple symbol. Oh, I see. Well, that uh, simple vantism. I don't know. My first day and there are three different kinds of photographs that we'll find within the dreams. Okay. How many more. There are some that are memories of her real life, there are the ones that teach us the controls, and then there are hints for the game. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah, they're doing, I think, a, a pretty good job tutorializing. I mean, I don't know. There's a lot within a small area, but I don't feel handheld, necessarily. Yeah, the one downside, I think, is that they've got the same tutorial pictures in every dream, because hmm. they don't know which one you're going to do first. Right, sure enough. Yeah. And if you're not careful, you can kind of get lost here among all yeah. the different angles you can get to. How hard would this be to find, you think, on a, on a first playthrough because i mean i don't know that i would have like picked out that tiny area in terms of having uh there are a couple of different ways to get to it great okay well that's not so bad then yeah and that picture there with the bottle and the word drain on it was one of the mm -hmm. clues uh, okay 
We'll see how those are used a bit later, but basically any photograph with a word on it is a clue to something you can do in the game. Sure, okay. Well, They're neat. generally really obvious, but occasionally that'll tell you where you need to look for something. Okay. Yeah, I'll tell you what this is reminding me of in a weird way, is uh, Loom. Just because... I found a photo of a you're, small you're seed lying in the grass. You're learning a number of symbols corresponding to things you can do, and mm -hmm. then you're asked to apply those to various situations that you find. So it's kind of like an abstract loom for me right now. Which, Loom was an amazing game. Oh yeah, it does kind of make sense. I loved Loom. Oh, it was so good. Maybe I just hope they would finally see what I'm doing. Yeah. I believe there is something in that tree. Cut the tree. Yep. Okay. And of course, none of the things that we see in those pictures are in this dream. They're all going to be in the other three dreams. Oh, really? Oh, that's neat. Well, that uh, that plays into the whole, you know, mind restructuring itself kind of thing. I guess we're learning to interconnect these different parts. I can of paint life. this symbol to turn right. Yeah, okay. Yep, so we can paint straight to either side to turn that direction. It just gives us turn right here, but obviously okay. the left works the same way. I like how you can kind of tell which direction you're supposed to go in by how it looks like it's streaking paint almost, you know? So mm -hmm. you get that full blob on the side you're closest to. That's neat. Yeah, this is a... This, I think, is a, an example of, like, a different art style, which maybe isn't... Uh, ooh, yeah, because that was a boulder that didn't have that symbol. Sure. Yep. Oh. And that's how we complete I the dream. I always think that lifting another of those weights will save me. Hmm. Ah! I even hold on to this hope as I like I'm that. driving. Alright. Again. So the weight was something which uh, was oppressive and crushing, but also was protecting her, maybe, from the uh, the stream of water there. That's what it seems to be. That's symbolism. And then every time we complete a dream, we get one Do of these cutscenes. think cut I can be back home okay. this month? Maybe. It depends on your progress. Mm -hmm. There is an exam in three weeks. I've been preparing for it for quite some time. There will always be another exam. I believe you should focus on your well-being first. Am I not doing that? I Maybe. think usually they're supposed to tie into the theme of the dream, but I'm not really sure how that one ties into getting obstacles out of your way or... Well, dealing um... Dealing with hurdles. I guess I, getting I have healed is the hurdle. Yeah, or the fact that she's more fixated on passing an exam than she is about um, yeah dealing with the right herself, problems. You know, yeah, right. Yeah. She's like, oh, I always think lifting quote another one of these will help me. Well, maybe the weight she's lifting is just whatever is next in front of her. Yeah, makes sense. So as awesome. you could probably see from the collection screen, every dream has a main ending and then three alternative endings. Oh. And is the main one good, I guess? Or like the well, the main one is the one that we got. We found the symbol in that dream, and we used it. Can draw this symbol to That's kind of neat. So, okay, you can go back and... Uh... But that symbol will also work in other Glass dreams. Everywhere. Sure. Since I started chasing ghosts, I neglected... Ah, oh, that is neat. I like that idea a lot. When I was a child, I didn't like playing with dolls. I prefer to building towers. It's kind of an engineering mindset there. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I know what this dream is about, and we'll get a better clue to it pretty soon. Okay, so there's a drain, it looks like, on the top of that wooden box? Yep. Okay. Yeah, um... And we're chasing a ghost, which is obviously when I was rich little, symbolism. The mm -hmm. ghost used to be a different person. I would collect pictures of him on a wall, like trophies. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure whether all of those are musicians. I recognize Michael Jackson in the yeah. bottom right. Sure. Can Looks kind of like Jeff Goldblum on the bottom oh, right. Oh, nice, yeah. And, and you match the... Uh, yeah, okay. You you match the um, I used to be able thing that I saw him draw. Yep. Somehow. Yeah, the symbol on those pictures is the one that we learned in this dream. Now. And nice. we need to use it to catch that ghost. Means to sure do. Back. Yeah, I see what you mean about the repetitions from photographs, but they aren't they don't look, seem like they're hidden particularly well, so, you know, whatever. Yeah, well those are the ones that you're supposed to be able to find pretty easily. The other sure. ones are kind of hidden. I like how they've uh, time-lapsed the ghost to be kind of a, you know, 
yeah. streaking. Yeah, again, the ghost it. is moving, but because these are still pictures, you can't see the ghost move, so it's just right. like an overexposure, basically, or a long-term yeah. exposure while he was running past. It's a photo but they... with one of those lens flares mm -hmm. on it. People sometimes claim they are ghosts. Catch the lens flare. All right. Yep. So when we see something that looks like a ghost, we'll be able to catch it using the symbol that we learned here. Right. And that photo was showing us the place where, in a different dream, we'll be able to use that symbol. Ah, that's neat. Man, this is... This is good. Okay, so yeah. Oh, that's not him. No, he's not standing still, so we can't capture him like this. Uh, okay, we need to not have him be streaking, or, or yep. whatever. We need to find where he's standing still. Oh, we know what to do with these. Yep, that's a familiar boulder. They look like, um... Oh, like, uh, like the outside of walnuts, you know what I mean? When they've still got the green on the outside of them. Yeah, a little bit. I All those bumps, I always think of a meteorite or something. Oh, yeah, sure. Like before the ghosts arrived. Okay, so when the ghost arrived, she stopped lifting the weights, I guess. And wow, off that goes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like to think that the alternative endings are kind of applying the lesson you learned in a different dream to the dream that you're in. Yeah. So. Oh, I see. So that was a... Uh... That was an alternative ending, then. Yep, there's one alternative ending for each of the symbols from the other three dreams. I see. Oh, that's neat. This is the dream. Oh, and so, if we get the main ending, then we will get that little video like clip I've afterwards or whatever. Right. That ghost. And that's what I'm going to do now, because there's only one other symbol that I've learned. These sure. machines were meant to do some heavy work, but they are of no use for catching Well, fair ghosts. enough. You're not going to catch it with a heavy Found lifter. Found a photo of a storm cloud. When you hold it upside down... Now that's a picture you might recognize. Yes, that's after we lifted the, uh, the boulder, the meteorite. Well, actually, that's that stormscape in the back that you were saying you might not have been able to find if you were the one playing. Oh, is it? Okay. What well, I guess I only thought place. of that because the fountain. Well, ah, never mind then. About it. Then, uh, then the answer is no, and I'm a big dummy. There he goes. Yep. So you can turn around and go back the way you came if you really wanted to. Yeah, sure. There's another one of those fruit trees. Yeah. I like this, I don't know, stark lighting nighttime kind of photograph. It's, uh, looks neat. Yeah, I think that's kind I of the way it has to go when you're close. chasing a ghost. Uh, fair chasing enough. Him gave me a sense of okay. Kind of looks like he's getting close to... Paint this symbol to turn right, around. yeah. Looks like you're getting close. Mm-hmm. Potentially, at least. I guess I don't know exactly yeah, where he's running into that building. Even a ghost can have a moment of weakness. Following his steps, and if you click one time too many, you go to right back to the start, and there's ah. no fast way to get back there. I need to find an end to but I, I don't mind stuff like that, first off, because I don't feel like there's that much of a penalty. Like, you can click back fairly quickly. Yeah. And secondly, that it's making a point, you know? I mean, it's, uh, well, presumably, it's got a symbolic reason. Mm -hmm. And there... Yeah, he looks like he's leaning over. I capture the ghost, but I realize the only thing holding this place together was my own ambition. Mm -hmm. So I let go. Ooh. Sorry, ghost. Yeah, the whole trail collapses. Neat. Uh, oh, also something else is happening. Oh gosh. So those are balloons, I guess? Eh, something like that. It was all just a front and flimsy. Yeah. That's neat. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the theme of that one is chasing your idols. About your parents. Sure. Trying to be like the people you admire. Yeah. Uh, there you go. They aren't anymore. I don't know. They have aged since then. Sure. I think parents are never too old to be role models for their children. But what if I am too old? Yeah, I dig it. I also, I really like the um, the dreamlike quality at the end of that scenario. Hmm. I, I feel like I've had a dream where, or it's like, kind of like an eerie feeling where it seems like everything is uh, like a stage for a play or like a fake a scenario or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they really do go a long way in the uh, you know, making it feel like it's a dream. Mm -hmm. This is it's... the thing I don't like about this dream is that you have to figure out which angle to go at before you can step away from the stupid uh, boulder. Yeah, right. 
But, yeah, remember this guy over here in the window? Is that a ghost in the window? That's a ghost in the window. I think this is one that my first time through I couldn't figure out until I found the picture. Yeah, sure. There we go. In my dreams, it is always night. It is lonely. Oh, hey! That is my favorite it's picture. My favorite I love uh, Edward Hopper's stuff. And the Night Cafe in particular. I thought that was Norman Rockwell. No, man, that's uh, that's Hopper. Oh, okay. Rockwell stuff is is a little more um, the homey, I guess. Yeah, I'm still. Makes sense. So there we go. We've used both of the symbols we've learned in both of the dreams we've been in so far. So time to go to yeah. number three. Absolutely. Also, thank goodness I just did a little Google image search and I was right. <laughs> I was I was afraid I was going to be wrong. But like, oh, it's my favorite painting, and it was it was not. Anyway. This is the dream. Where I am supposed to. Well, I don't know a whole lot about art. Yeah. This game is about the closest I get. I, this is good, though. This is much better than the other art game I've played. I'll say that. I don't much. remember going this way. Makes no difference anyway. So it seems like they're introducing Simple elements. Means to move back. Oh. They're el elements of. Like, it's a dream, but at the same time, she's in places she's never been before. So, you know, may not be exactly just pulling from her memory. Yeah, um, well, all the dreams definitely represent something visually. So this dream sure. is about the way that she's always following expectations. Somebody yeah. sets out a road to follow with arrows, and that's I the way she's got to go. Sure. To turn left. Of course, we're not going to go that way. No, you got to go off-road. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, this area is pretty they confusing. Really want you to know your way. Sure. And yeah, it looks like it... Yeah, go ahead. It probably would have made more sense conceptually to do the main ending of this one before they this ending. Okay. But. Ah, a ghost! Yep. Get him. Grip that ghost. Oh, it's fine. We'll, we'll get the main ending in just a little bit, I guess. Yeah, Thank just some of the symbolism you. here doesn't make as much sense until you've seen the main ending of this one. Sure. Oh. But all they do is set up yet. Because that's a wall that we have to get through in this dream. I see. Okay. So. And so the yeah. idea is those those people, quote unquote, are setting up the the walls themselves or whatever, or they may yeah. be fake walls or whatever. They're they're showing you what they think is the path forward, but really it's a wall in your way. Got this it. Dream where I, am I like it. To follow this and I do feel that that I actually feel like that's an important message. I don't know the idea of. Um, oh, sure enough, there's the wall. Mm -hmm. I thought they wanted me to follow the road. Why did they make it so I don't know, the the idea of moving from just fulfilling expectations to sort of finding your own thing to do. The symbol means to turn. Yeah, around. some of the pictures of her real life get into a bit of that. And you know, we already saw the one where they wanted her to play with dolls, but she wanted to right. build towers instead. Sure, sure. Yeah. Yeah, you know, given her... Uh, it's a neat world. It's not made for living. Well, that's a good quote. I, I like that. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, giving giving her a way that they think is correct forward, but which in fact is not appropriate. And again, like I was saying, like the, like the graduation of move. Oh, we gotta turn. Uh, the graduation of moving from simply fulfilling expectations to sort of finding your own. Another wall. This one. Is and, and I feel like some people never quite make it to that stage. You know. I can mm -hmm. draw this symbol to move I don't know. I'm, I'm going on here because... Yeah, well, I think it might actually be the other way around. That, you know, people are telling her what to do in life because yeah. they know what's best for her, but what she wants to do is something different. I see. And there's a matter of having to choose which is right. Something is sure. Now, I finally found the symbol for this dream. There we go. That's a bit out of the way. Yep. I need to find a train that isn't clocked yet. And and again, you kind of have to leave the road in order to figure out how to continue on the road. Symbolism. I don't remember going this way. Makes no difference anyway. Right. And there's another train. Yeah, just in case you missed the first one. I see. Yeah, well, that's fine. So now we've learned how to drain things. It's good. The trees seem artificial. More of that uh, artificial world symbolism popping up. Yep, and somewhere around here, there's something that took me absolutely forever to find when I was doing the playthrough before I recorded this one. Hmm. It does seem like the geometry of this level's a bit odd. It's... Well, there's the main road, and then there's a uh, one path that branches off it, and there's a staircase that leads between the two of them. 
Oh yeah, wow. That seemed a bit out of the way. I would probably It's a photo of what I think is a fruit cut tree. It. Cut the tree. Mm -hmm. Um yeah, it probably would have taken me forever to find that as well. Just because you could so easily kind of gloss over it mouse wise. Yeah, that'll take us back towards the tunnel, and there, lying in the ground, oh, is the man. tiny seed that we saw in a picture somewhere. Look at that. I thought it looked a bit organic. Go, seed. Even the problems here are small. Fly. But they spread to grow elsewhere. Hmm. Well, that could be that uh, could be symbolic as well, you know. Um, maybe earlier in life, when you're following directions, quote unquote, doing what people want you to do, then uh, it's not too hard to bear. Like you don't mind doing that, but yet the root of that complacency and this not taking whatever to responsibility for things on your own spreads to cause problems elsewhere in your life. I thought they wanted me to follow. Who knows? Them. Yeah, or, you know, not doing the right thing early in life because yeah. someone told you to do differently kind of... Sure. ...grows Messes on things you. Up for later. Despite its solid appearance, the barrier turns out to be tenuous. Hmm. That's actually a cool effect. I like that one. Ha! I wonder if the other discarded drains earlier were from similar events. I mean, I guess we created all of this area, so who knows? Yeah, could be. At the beginning, I was very happy at law school. It seemed like such a good idea, but only because it wasn't Well, mine. there we have it. Mm hmm Yeah, she went to law school to make her parents happy, but oh. it's not what she wanted to do. That's right. Remember, kids, back during Nito King say, drop out of law school. The Drop out of law one. school if it's not what you want to do, or even no, better, don't go always, there in the first place. Always drop out. It's the only thing that'll make you happy. Live the way we do, supporting ourselves the through Patreon. Of the tunnel feels no, we don't. Oddly familiar. I, I don't even have a Patreon. Yeah, I don't either. I'm not, I, I'm I can't not. stand the thought that someone would actually want to give me money for this. It's bizarre. No, um, yeah. No, I, I do this for entertainment. I do this for fun. Yep. I don't like the idea of having to, uh, produce actual quality. I just like to, just like to talk over video games, man. I don't know. I and we're back to the start. Oh, yeah. But this time, getting back but to the I start was the point. Oh. Even, even the problems are small, small. Makes more sense now. Yep, the whole world is small, and we went all the way around it. I see, I see. Much as the vision for her life that other people might have had would be a small vision. See, she outgrew it. How long should I expect to stay here? In this water glass? There are no expectations. Whoa. Isn't that what good doctors are supposed to give? Hope? A perspective? Expectations can also belittle success. Facing expectations, the best you can hope for is to fulfill them. Hmm. So, what am I supposed to do? Looks like there's spikes in her brain activity there. Or something. I saw yeah. some red circle on a spiky chart. I think she's recovering bit by bit by going through all these dreams and sure. learning whatever lessons. Yeah. But of course, now we've learned a new symbol, we can go into the other dreams and use it. Oh, yeah. This is the dream where I find We can drain things. Which yeah. Well, we yeah. were... We reverse drained this thing before, so now I guess we gotta find the uh I decided to Oh that's right, it's up, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. So she's talking as if these have been like recurring dreams throughout her life, maybe, or maybe just since the car accident, or I think it's just since the car accident that's kind of the impression that I got. But sure. I don't know that that's necessarily the case. No, I could I could definitely see that. I mean, certainly she wouldn't have had these anti-law school dreams all of her life, although I could imagine she might have had it all throughout law school or what have you. No. I this certainly... is the other problem, is trying to navigate even once you know where you're going. There's a storm yeah. cloud in the night sky. Might be raining. I'm in the mood for Yeah, that now. looks like a funnel cloud. And a funnel cloud means... 
Looking at the rigid concrete, I wish something would stir this place up. Ooh. It's like Inception in here. And we're just draining away all the buildings. Yeah. That is startling power. But, I mean, I guess this is all just our mindscape, so... Alright. Here we go. And then, of course, we apply the idea of breaking expectations to the following of our role models. Which I would think would be an excellent um, application to that particular... Chasing a ghost. Grass everywhere. Since I started chasing ghosts, I neglected this place. Oh, I literally just got the whole, the ghost used to be somebody different. Like, she used to want to be the, the music people. Ah, I could have figured that out earlier, I guess. Ooh. Eggs? I used to be able to get blood from... Oh, no, those are platelets. At least I tried. Weird. Or are they red blood cells? That's what I mean to say, yeah. Well, they can... Yeah. Huh. All right. Somebody orders some red blood cells. Yep. Well, that's all three of the endings we can get in all three of the first dreams, so right. it's time to move on to the final dream. I took the road less traveled by, and that quote has made all the difference. This is the dream where I am looking for a hidden path. Hmm. Yeah, this one's probably the hardest to navigate, just because the ways you need to go are more difficult to find. Sure. They put up those billboards. Are they trying to cover up something with them? That's paranoid thinking right there, lady. Yeah, I'm trying to get back outside so I can look at the billboards, but oh yeah, can't get I there from bridges. here. There must be yeah, the the geometry seems a bit odd. Somehow, I find myself above the okay. road. Okay. Yeah, the only thing I could think of was go back to the uh, you know, go to the above the road scene and then sure. find my way back down. It seems I'm not the first to look for a road less traveled. Hmm. Maybe there is no such thing. But yeah. you do have these symbols lighting your way. Yep. From time to time there is a clear And there's a there's gonna be a point where I can zoom in on one. enough to rest. Okay. It feels like I'm making a mistake. Tell you what this reminds me of is geocaching. Have you ever been out geocaching? I have not. It is great fun when you're tromping through the bushes looking for an old jar full of a log book and other treasures. Hmm. Yeah. The symbol means yeah, I think we're back on the road now. Yeah, yeah, there you go. These do seem to follow sort of a progression. Like, I feel like this makes narrative sense after the last ones, the idea of looking for a hidden road. Of course, mm -hmm. maybe it would work anyway. You know, maybe I would come to a greater understanding of all the dreams. As I unlock the others... The road seems to go on forever. Mm. My parents moved after I got my own place. I always forget that my old bedroom doesn't exist anymore. They say you can't go home, I guess. Or is it you can't go to the same home twice? Ha, <laughs> that's right. And if your home is a river, then... Uh... They claim to have the answers. They don't even have the right questions. I would buy a product if its advertisement was make your troubles go away. Yeah! There you go. Drain away all them all them advertisements. Was that symbol in the bush, was that supposed to be our, our fourth symbol for this dream? Yep, that's the symbol for cut. I see, I see. Alright. This is the so dream. I could go back Where to the first three dreams and yeah. get those hidden endings, but I'm saving those for later. There'll be time for that later. Yep. Oh, and we've seen that lens flare elsewhere. Oh yeah, that's a ghost lens flare. Yeah, I remember that. But I'm gonna go around first. They put up those billboards. Sure. Are they trying to cover up something with them? I like the billboard that just says security. This place seems familiar. It actually says a lot more than that, I think. It's like a whole spiel about whatever company it's advertising. Hmm. Presumably some insurance or something like that. And that was the clue back there, I guess, for catching the ghost in the first dream. Yep. There we go. Oh, and we've started a ghost trail. I once tried to follow the road. I was moving. 
but I never got anywhere. That was neat. Vaguely nightmarish. Yeah, I think the game is kind of meant to feel disconcerting. Sure. Yeah, I do get the sense. I mean, in the in the the little this clips at the, the end, it feels like things might be okay. But was, when I'm in here, I, I definitely get the sense the that something is off. To go on forever. They put up those billboards. Are they trying to cover up something with them? Yeah, it's one thing that's kind of nice and also kind of annoying is that if you leave the dream and then come back in, she'll repeat all the lines that you heard before. Yeah. I mean, on the one hand, I guess it gives you a nice, uh, you know, you remember where you are and get the whole spiel again, but on the other hand. All right, can we... Yep. I can paint this symbol so to... We got fruit back. trees in our way. Cut them. Cut the fruit trees. That's fine. Symbolism. I begin cutting my way. And this dream is kind of unique because we've got to do it more than once. Oh, interesting. Okay. This is not a shortcut. Nope, we're forging our own path. Mm-hmm. That's right, show some initiative. The path seems to go on forever. But it is pretty enough. <laughs> I can see the Pressing thistle. Pressing never stops feeling like a mistake. But after some time, even backtracking does. Hmm. So we can go backwards, and you might notice back there some familiar boulders on top of some poles. Oh, sure, yeah. But I'm not going to mess with those right now. Sure, that'll be We're going to finish be. this thing. Yeah, do this the right way. No, well, I just don't want the real now. ending to be the last one I get. Only takes oh, I see. Yeah, fair enough. And I think we're at the end of the road. Nice. Ooh. It's one of those dreams that never ends. Oh, bleh. I see you, red blood cells. You didn't get away from me. It seems to continue. Even when I'm awake. Hmm. With every heartbeat. See, we broke up a blood clot's what we did there. Saved our lives. Maybe. Yeah, that does seem to be what happened. Maybe, because it just started to beat at the very end. Are you looking forward to going back home? I thought I did. I'm not sure anymore. Aren't you eager to continue? Doing what? You know, living. I guess not. I'm living now, aren't I? And with all four endings complete, we get the epilogue. Mm. Here we go. She's finally going home. Yeah. Nice little rucksack she's got there. I think that was Rugrats themed. But after all that, she's not really happy. No, you can tell. She still has some... trauma? Uh. <laughs> yep. With Christian Majewski. Well, that was great, actually. I really like that. I mean, it's baffling, I agree. There's, there's a whole lot going on in it, but... Uh... I tell you, it was tight level design. I mean, I didn't have to navigate, so I can't speak to that. But, you know, I like the concepts. I like the execution. Uh, yep. I, yeah. Graph, and you know. what do you say we discuss the symbolism while we go back and collect all the stuff I missed? Beautiful. Let's us do it.